So bit of a bit of an update on the Crown Northampton Halloween Creme XL Overstone Derby trainers. Uh, just just to show how they wear. So I've probably worn them about 30 or 40 times. Um, as I said before in the unboxing video, really comfortable straight out of the box. So oh, I'll just hit me. Um, like no no particular issues, no hot spots, um, didn't hurt the toes, no blisters from them. Uh, yeah, like really, really pleased with them. The one thing I will say, so the Halloween Creme XL, I, I wouldn't say it's particularly durable in the long run in the sense it does pick up like little scuffs and scratches and doesn't bother me in the slightest. Uh, and based on my experience, uh, this this wallet's made from Halloween Creme XL. Uh, it's about a year old and you can see it just picks up little dinks here and there but you compare that i've got um a shell cordovan horsehide card holder somewhere and that is like pretty much bulletproof so just to just to show you so you see there and the one thing i would say about the leather is it is an absolute dust magnet uh, it just seems to like to pick up dust um not really a not really a deal breaker for me but some some people are more particular about these things than others and um, you can see there there's there's a little bit it looks worse in the video actually but there's a little bit of blooming i think um just from where the oils and the leather have um, just sort of i don't know, don't know how you call it just saturated in in different ways you do not actually notice it in the flesh is it's just a case of the video and the light hitting it I say it does does seem to um you can see the dust just just in there and it, it just um you wipe it off and it just picks it up walking around throughout the course of the day um couple of nicks here and there so it, it does pick up I was saying about the Halloween Creme XL it does pick up um there's again you can't really it's very faint in the flesh and um, that bit blooming but it looks it looks far worse in the video um yeah a couple of nicks here and there and that is you know i'm not being kicking the fuck out of people or running down mountains or anything like that just walking around town one or two nights out but in the joys of the pandemic nothing um nothing too extravagant or extreme so if you're really precious about you know picking up nicks and scuffs i would probably suggest going for one of the different leather options uh but it's entirely up to you like i say it doesn't bother me really comfortable really pleased with them um yeah yeah what's what's not to like um i have also just picked up the Oh, the TL ones in white. So I'll do a separate video just in terms of doing a bit of a comparison. So my understanding of the TL ones, I've not opened them yet, is the padding around the ankle and the toe is a lot thinner. So I'll do that video separately. Cheers. Bye.